You know what? Let's let's not do this. Why don't we both tell Dan together and we'll both find Charlie together? Fine. Let's go. Look at this place. We've been, we've been gone two years. Feels like 20. Is Raina here? No, she's not. She uh, has to be alone. Is everything okay? Not really. You seem a little shaken up yourself. What's going on? Charlie said something kind of weirded me out. I'm hoping it's just a crazy misunderstanding and not actual crazy. What'd she say? Uh, well, uh, we were kissing, you know, and then things started to, you know, as soon as she says, call me Serena. What? Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Are you sure? I mean, maybe that's just what you wanted to hear. Nice one, but yeah. Yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> no, but if she really did say that, like, that's definitely weird. Just tell her that's not necessary and get back to doing whatever it is you tell her to do. What's Chuck doing here? Gossip said he was going to rehab. Yeah, that's... Another long story. About where it's St. Jude's, and now suddenly I'm back out of the loop with everything? Look, I'll tell you later, I promise. Miss Walworth, I can't find Blair. Well, she's bound to be here somewhere. She left well before me. Oh, here's the princess and Louis. Do you think she missed the opportunity to enter her old stomping ground on the arm of the prince? She is finally getting her fairy tale. She doesn't need the big, bad wolf to ruin it. Why don't you say goodbye once and for all and let her go? Hey, you know, school was more like this during the day. I think I might have enjoyed it. Thank God. Some days were Bonsoir, Upper East Siders. Are you enjoying the party as much as I am? I know one person who isn't. And this is our beautiful Milo. He's 10 months old, the little guy. OMG, so cute. Is he sleeping through the night? From 8 till 6. I get up with him so Georgina can sleep in. Your life sounds perfect. It is. So how did you two meet? Well, that's a real romantic story. Phil wanted a hot wife to impress his partners, and I wanted a loft and a legacy at Yale for Milo. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going to go get drunk enough to make you all seem interesting. Dan! Oh, of course you'd be here. Oh, I can tell that you're up to something. Please let me in on it. I haven't been to sports since I believed in Jesus. If I was up to something, and I'm not saying that I am, the last thing I would want is Georgina Sparks getting involved. Not unless the thing was twisted and nasty, in which case my help could prove invaluable. How's the party? Oh, I, I promise, Mom, you're not missing anything. Unless trying to convince headmistress Queller to grade her kids more harshly is exciting. Check your email. Thank you. You're a good son.